Hi guys, Michael here. <clears throat> um, you have to forgive me for the lack of videos. I know I've been leaving it a while anyway between videos usually, but uh, I'm kind of made up with the uh, flu right now. Pretty bad. So I'm probably going to have to edit the hell out of this to take out all the sn sniffles and coughing and when my voice breaks and that kind of thing. So if I miss anything and anything, you hear me cough or sneeze or anything, I'll sniffle, please. You know, don't get too upset about it. I just missed it, but you can bet there's been a lot. And you can bet up to this point where you've been listening to, I've already done it several times. I've already edited several things out. Anyway, so what I'm going to do is, I don't really feel up to doing a a gaming video right now, because I am aching all over and that. So, <clears throat> but I did want to get a video out. So what I'm going to do is a quick q and A. I didn't. I haven't advertised it because I've got enough questions been asked me uh, recently that I can ask, answer them. And so I'm going to do that, get them out of the way, and then I'll be back to gaming again um, soon. Hopefully, as soon as I can get better. So let's have a look. So the first question is. Oh yeah, it's about. I'm going to answer all these. They, they've been asked by a few, a couple of different people. Like, um, it's all to do with collaborations. Uh, I know you keep asking about this, and yes, I am going to still do collaborations. I know I keep saying so, but I've been really busy recently. It's not an excuse. Commentators know how life can be. Sometimes it's really busy. Sometimes it's in, and you can do stuff. It's been really busy. Usually, with how my life runs, <clears throat> I can record in the early hours and still get up early-ish in the day and still get everything done that I've got to do in the day. So, um, but recently I've had a really busy day, uh, days, every day, and not been very well as well. So I've been actually going to bed at a reasonable hour and my sleep pattern's kind of got back into a normal sleep pattern. So the people I tend to look towards collaborating with right now, uh, Willow West and uh, Acuras 2, they're, as I've said before, they're American, so they're up when I'm asleep. So I haven't been able to see them yet or talk to them yet. Um, but I'm glad you, I'm glad you guys, you know, want, want us to still do. You know, I've asked about, I've asked me about doing stuff. I'm, yeah, I'm going to look into it. I am on the sleep, but as soon as I'm better, I'll get my, <laughs> I'll screw my sleep pattern up again. Uh, and thinking, I'm, I'm trying to see when they're, I'm, I'm going to have to get in touch with them and find out when their live streams are and then I'll join them on their live streams a few times, yeah I'll stay up purposely like go to sleep a little bit so I can get up purposely and stay with them for an hour or two and watch the live stream take part, things like that but right now, until I'm fully better, uh, yeah I'm just going to have to wait, but I've kind of fell behind on everything I haven't been watching videos that much, I haven't been doing anything, really just a lot of relaxing and taking medicines and things like that, but yeah, you know, it is what it is. I'll get, I'll get there, and as soon as I can, I tell you, as soon as, as soon as I'm better, I will get in touch with them, and I will join them on their live streams. I'll even, you know, make sure I tell you when I'm going on. If anybody wants to come in, then they can, and you can talk to me in there and that kind of thing as well. But yeah, you know, we'll sort that out when I'm better. But I will let you know. Keep an eye on my Twitter. You know, I'll type it there. Okay, next. Well, uh, so this is going to be a little different uh, to what I usually do because I've been asked a question about something non-gaming. Non so, yeah, okay, I'll answer it. You want to know if I like Walking Dead, the TV series, since I've played all the Walking Dead games by Telltale. And what I think of the start of season seven. Yes, I'm a big fan. I've watched all the seasons. I've watched every episode. So you could say I'm quite a, quite a big fan. I've even read the comics. Or read most of the comic. Not all of it, but most of it. Um, what do I think of season seven? That first episode. I thought it was spot on. It were way, way it had to be. I mean, to me, it was obvious that it was going to be Abraham first. Yeah, just by his demeanour, he's a soldier. Um, 
you got to remember Negan did all this. Oh, by the way, there's spoilers in this. So, if you don't want to know how to anything, just don't listen. Mute me, jump, skip, skip video. I don't know, but you need a spoiler alert. Yeah, is your spoiler alert? Spoiler, spoiler, S spoiler. That's your spoiler. Alert. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo. That's, your, that's it. That's your spoiler alert. So yeah, I expected Negan to kill him because you know all this was set up to break Rick, and um, he knew that if he broke Rick, he's got this soldier guy here that people might lock onto for strength. And he was, he's going to—he's going to take some breaking because he's, you know, he's obviously like military. And uh, he has to ask himself, and Negan had to ask himself, is this big guy worth breaking? I mean, Negan probably could break him eventually, but is it worth the effort? And that says no, because he's here to break Rick. He's not here to break Abraham. And Abraham's going to be more trouble than he's worth. And as I said, if Rick breaks, people will lock on to the next strongest person, which you can bet would have been Abraham. Even if you just look how Abraham was, where he was stiff backed and looking in his eyes, you could tell. So, Abraham was obviously the first choice, had to be. Um, second episode, I. So, oh, yeah, and then, of course, Glenn was the best next choice because, as I saw it, there was, there was two people there who didn't need Rick for strength and they didn't need Abraham for strength, and that was Maggie and Glenn. And that's because, and I'm going to get a bit cringy here, but their love for each other kept them strong. Because they were having a baby together, you know, while ever Maggie was alive and okay, Glenn would be strong. While ever Glenn was okay and alive, Maggie would be strong. So, that left 10%, you could say, left that of, of strength left in that group that, that could have still fought back. So, he took that 10% away by killing Glenn. So, it was obviously the wisest two choices, I think, just from a logical point of view. And, uh, yeah, I think I'd have picked same. Um, what's next? Oh, do I... <laughs> do I blame... Wait, though, I'm just quickly saying uh, episode two. Episode two was excellent. Um... I like King Ezekiel. It looks a lot like he does in the comic. They really picked somebody who looks a lot like the comic character. So it was great. His interaction with Carol were great. It was nice to see someone who didn't fall for that smiling bullshit that she does. But it was funny seeing her do it. I was I laughing my, my ass off. Just watching her. Just with a fake smile. Doing all that she was doing. And uh, yeah, I can't, I like him. I like him. I know what happens to him in comics. I'm not going to go into that because, of course... That could still come up and that. and uh, But, yeah, I, I like him. So, hopefully, him and Carol will get on. And maybe Carol could be a queen. Because yeah. <laughs> Carol's my favourite, well, probably my favourite uh, character. I just think her transition from battered wife to, you know, kill kill any, anything that moves, if need be, is excellent. I'm, I think I could be kind of like her in that situation. Because people say, oh, I couldn't do do any of that. But well, you could. You'd be surprised what you could do if your life or people you loved were on the line. You know, if I was protecting myself or people I loved, yeah, I could. I, I'd kill somebody, you know, it's just, if, that's what it, if that's what it comes to. If you've got no choice, it's you or them, then it's going to be them. Yeah, I, I know I could do that. It would mess me up to start with. But I think, like you would in that kind of situation, you'd learn to get used to it. You'd learn to cope. And I think that, um, I think Carol's just amazing with, with, with how she's done that. You know, she doesn't go out to kill. She doesn't set out to kill, but she will kill. If, uh, you know, she'll, kill, she'll, she'll try and kill 100 zombies on her own, or 100 men on her own, 100 humans on her own, if it will save the group. So, uh, so yeah, that was a great episode. And I think her and Morgan are acting together really well, which I like. So, um, oh, yeah, do, do I blame Daryl? For Glenn's death. Actually, I blame Daryl and Glenn, I think. Because at the end of the day, it seems like he understood when Glenn came out. He says the first one's free. And then Daryl punched him, and so he killed Glenn. But yet, Glenn had already used up that free use by jumping out. If he'd stayed in his spot, then, yeah, Daryl punching him still might have made him kill Glenn. He might have not given him a chance since it were a punch in the face. But... You know, he, he might have done. He might have said, okay, I understand emotions are high. You get that one free. So the fact Glenn had jumped out earlier when he shouldn't have done 
also lost them that first, you know, that first um, chance. So yeah, you could say that in that way, Glenn was part of the own, uh, uh, part of the architect of his own demise in that respect. So yeah, I think it were a mixture of uh, uh, them two. Um, I'm looking forward to the next episode. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. I don't know if they'll be covering. I'm guessing you'll see more of Rick and Negan and all that. So it's going to be interesting. There you go. So that's all. The, I think that's all the Walking Dead stuff out of the way. Yeah, I mean, I do know what happens to a lot of the characters in the comic uh, of what's to come. Of course, in the comic, Carol's already dead. She never left the prison. She died. Abraham died where Denise died with an arrow in the back of his head coming through his coming through his eye, but. Denise took that death and he got killed by Negan. Now, of course, Daryl was never in comic. He's just been created for TV series, so there is no comic for him. That's what I mean. I can't, he's, he's the odd man out, Daryl. I don't really know anything about him. I don't know if he went before when he dies or whatever because he ain't in comic. He's alive. He's alive only in TV series. So he's the wild card. Uh, next. What, yeah, what game am I, am I playing next? Well, to be honest with you, I'm not playing any games next because I've got plenty going right now. And so I'm going to be trying to do them. But what I think I am going to do, I've got to really. And I've been, I don't know why I've been putting it off. I just don't, I just don't want to bring an end to it. But I think I'm going to push to finish the Telltale games off. Uh, Telltale, uh, the Tales from the Borderlands. Not because I want to finish it. I really don't. I want it to last forever. But, uh, it's been going on long enough and I think I've just got to... I know it's all ended now and everything's there to be done, so I'm just going to end it. I'm just going to... Not end, not end I don't mean I'm going to stop. I mean, I'm just going to... I might bat, I'm just going to start to bring out Tales from the Borderlands episodes until I've done the series. So, I usually end up doing six... Between six and eight episodes... A, uh, six and eight parts per episode... Of course, when they say episode, they mean the whole section, you know, like episode four, episode four. So I'll, I end up doing like six to eight parts per episode. So I'm on episode four, so I've probably got three or four left on that. And then I'll have, have episode five and that'll finish it. Uh, and that'll be that one out of the way. So, yeah. What else have we got? Um... So I've been asked if I'm going to start by the same person who asked about what I thought the TV series for Walking Dead. I've just seen you ask me another question. Uh, I'm asking, I've, I've ever thought doing a, another channel covering like spoken game reviews or TV reviews of movies or fil or things what people ask me to review. Uh, no, I haven't. I haven't thought about it. I think if I were going to do another channel doing that kind of thing, doing reviews and you know all that kind of stuff for, for anything, I think I would. I think I should, it would have been something I should have done a while ago. I don't think it's something people would be interested in, to be honest. I don't mind answering like this if you ask me a Q, on a Q and A what I think of a certain TV program or a, or a certain movie or something or an old game or something. I'll I'll, I'll give you my opinion. It'll always be honest. But I don't think it would be anything that people would really want to see on a regular basis. So, nah, I don't think I'd start in the channel. I'm, I'm, I'm happy with what I've got. I mean, it's not something I ever really thought of because I don't think it's ever something. Like I say, I just don't think it's something that'd catch on. So, no, <laughs> that's the answer. Right. So, oh yeah, horror. Am I going to play a horror game soon? Uh. I might look into it. I might look into it, but first of all, I can't play anything right now because I've still got to finish so many things. And though you've got to remember, Don't Starve is not a, an ending game, really, unless you get killed, and even then, usually you start again. And yeah, you know, it, it's very. It just keeps going. So there's a lot. You, you never really actually get to a proper end. On there's never actually no end and end credits. We don't starve. So you know, it's like. And I'll take it going as long as I can, so that could take a while. So there's that. And then, like I said, I've only just started Batman, uh, Telltale's Batman. And I've got, you know, Tales from the Borderlands finish up. And, yeah, I've got other things as well. I've got so I've got Shipwrecked and things, which I'm still meaning, meaning to do. So I've got plenty of things right now. And uh, so, no, 
I won't be I won't, I won't be doing a horror game right now, but I will do a horror game. There is some horror stuff coming out soon. I've got my eye on stuff, so um, I'll I'll yeah. I'll bring it here as uh, if I decide to do it. I'll definitely do it. Or I might even take suggestions if somebody wants me to play a specific horror game. You know, I'll open it up and you can send me suggestions and yeah, I'll I'll have a look at it. So and if it's not a game that'll take me too long, because you've got to remember, I haven't got cable yet. I'm hoping, still hoping we get it soon, but I haven't got it yet, so I'm still slow. So if you pick me a game that's going to take, that's going to got like hundred hours of gameplay. Then I might not accept it, but you know I don't know yet. But I might, I might just play parts of it just to get just so you can hear me scream, you know that kind of thing. But otherwise, no, I don't think uh, I ain't got anything planned right now. And if I do decide to do some more games, then you can. I promise you, promise, promise, promise. I will ask you uh, if you if you've got suggestions, and you can send them me, and I'll write them in on comments, whatever. <sighs> I think that's it. Let me just look. Oh, no, 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 no. Have I seen the Doctor Strange movie? Uh, no, not yet. But I've heard it's absolutely amazing. So I am actually going to watch it, go watch it soon. Um, I'm not because of my, my illness, so I'm, because I'm going to watch it at the, at the cinema. I'm not really going to go while, while I'm ill. But yeah, I, I like Benedict Cumberbatch. I think he's amazing. Um, and I like Tilda Swinton. I think she's absolutely phenomenal. There's a there's a huge good cast. Mad 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 Mad, mad uh, Ping Pong. <laughs> oh my! F mad Mickelson, I like him of course. For he played Hannibal in the series, TV series Hannibal. He is in it as well as a as a bad guy. So yeah, I like I like quite a few of these um, these actors and actresses that are in it. Chortle, a GF4, he's also in it, and he's a really good actor. He's got a lot of talent, been in a lot of things. And he's uh, in it's seen some stuff to come, so I like him. Hard name to say, but he is a really good actor. And uh, oh, Benedict Wong, he's in it as well, which is which is he's cool as well. So yeah, I, I'm I'm looking forward to watching it when I'm when I'm when I'm ill when I'm ill when I'm better. I am looking forward to watching it, and I'll I'll let you know if you want me to tell you in the next Q and A what I think about it. I'll give you an honest review. Uh, it'll be a quick one, of course, just like I've been doing. But yeah, I don't mind. Oh, one more thing I've been asked is uh, I've asked on a on uh, YouTube, uh, am I going to be doing "Don't Starve Together" with uh, subscribers? It's something I'd like to do. It's a, one of those never say never moments because I've learned not to do that because it's possible. So I would like to do that. I'm looking into setting that kind of thing up. You know, there's a lot of things I want to sort out first, and once I've sorted them, then it is something I honestly want to look into. So. Uh, I'll let you know. I'll definitely let you know if that kind of thing is going to come up so you can then get in touch and tell me if you want to be part of it or whatever. But it is something, put it this way, it's something I would really, really like to do. So, yeah, it is a, it is definitely a possibility. Okay, so that's it, guys. I'm looked down. There isn't anything else I really need to do. So, uh, sorry this wasn't a proper gaming video. You know, like I said, I'm not, I'm just not well right now. But I am picking up. I'll be fine. I'll be back on soon you'll know when because a tales from the borderlands will appear in your box for you to watch and then you'll know that michael's better again okay because i haven't got any recorded right now uh oh and what well, sorry, sorry 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 i was just looking through emails and i found another can i post a picture of my um keyboard right now uh i'll tell you what I haven't got a picture of this, well, I'll actually take a picture in a second then. When I stop this, I'll take a picture and I'll add it on, and you'll see it about now. It's one I'm using currently, I've actually, between keyboards, I've just taken, the one I actually had, I've just got rid of it. I bought this one about four months ago, five months ago, just as a backup in case I needed it. But my other one started to play up, so I'm between keyboards, I'm after another keyboard, a good one. So I'm just putting this one in as a backup for now. So this is what I'm using right now. And uh, yeah, so there you go. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Or listening, I should say, more than watching. It's because I've got to think of a game to put this back in. There's a back in visual to this. Because I know if you get bored of listening to me, at least you can watch the game. So I'll think of something. It's probably going to be League of Legends or something. That's what I usually do. <laughs> anyway that guys thanks for listening and watching and whatever and i'll speak to you soon you take really good care of yourselves and goodbye for now